Boom, bam. Yes, people. So, just a quick one. Just to confirm. This video here was recorded about three weeks, two and a half, three weeks after my first audit video. So this was not conducted during the lockdown. Just to confirm. This was not conducted during the lockdown. This, con this was conducted two and a half months ago, something like that. Two or three weeks after I'd done my first audit and it was not conducted during lockdown so I do not want anyone dropping any comments on some red flag Rick shit about you shouldn't be outside why aren't you locked down because this was not conducted during lockdown so um yeah there's not too much really that happens in this video just as a heads up but it's interesting to reflect back upon it a few months later um, in the sense that this was only two or three weeks after I'd gone there the first time and you all saw the reaction that I got now I was jumped on within about 30 seconds of being there this time I was there for at least half an hour, 45 minutes, something like that maybe an hour even and um, yeah let's have a look at what happens but just a quick one I want to give a shout out to my subscribers um, Blackheart, thank you for your contribution lately you made some brilliant contributions in the comment sections some things that some people should really go and have a look at. Um, have a look at the commonlawtrust.com. I think that's the website, commonlawtrust.com. Um, big ups to um, Tyrant Finder UK, of course. Uh, True Reporter, True Reporter, as always. Um, there's a load of you, man. But, um, yeah, big ups to everyone that's making some useful contributions with some useful links and things to help us navigate through these difficult times. So, uh, yeah, basically big respects to anyone that's actually trying to contribute stuff that's really helping us to move forward. Um, people that are helping us understand the implications and the many different um, anomalies that surface from looking at the regulations and the bill and these sorts of things. Um, so, yeah, big ups to everyone that's staying educated, educating others, self-educating, giving out information that's, that's really useful. So, um big ups to all of you that are doing that so um yeah here's the video from the revisit second visit to accord uk and um power to the people and all of that so watch it like comment share the thing subscribe um got loads more comment on the way comment content loads more content on the way and so, um, yeah, stay safe, stay strong. It's just his. We'll be back again soon. So, um, for now, enjoy and peace out. Blam. Yes, yes, people. So, we're back here again at Accord UK on our return trip. I'm at it this time. My partner, my dad. And uh yeah. We'll see if their attitude and approach is different this time and see if they respect our right to photograph and uh record. So um let's see how it goes. This is how it gets spotted so quick. Jump on us.
first time, so I'll see if he goes and gets too curious. Got a feeling, but I didn't catch it on camera. Got a feeling that that person in the car, the car is not just there, uh, was the main security person from last time. That's my initial feeling anyway. It was a, uh, a bold dude in a high vis again, so it wouldn't surprise me if it's the same guy. We got one on the phone for the Poco. Just hiding behind the smoking cages. Whatever it is. Just in there, poking his little sweetheart. He might be on the phone to his missus or something, but... Don't care what he said or says. They say I'm anti-social. They say I'm anti-social.